Hey, how you doing? Uh, welcome to the penthouse suite. Uh, let's take a look around. Who is it? I mean, you know we got the cribs. We got the cribs we put here. Uh, I guess I can put away the reading for a little bit. Yeah, just doing some homework. I uh, got my chemistry over here. Give you a headache. Probably one of the hardest classes, but man, do the work. So this is it, you know. We like to keep everything nice and tidy, you know. Sorry about the rug. You got a, we got the bare skin rug in the dry cleaner, so you know, it's rough life to live out here, but walk over here and look at our view, you know. Beautiful view out here in Minnesota we got. So you see it at night, you know, it's real beautiful, but we do what we can. We got us up here on the fifth floor in the penthouse. No big deal. This is uh, you know, we got these lights imported straight from, you know, right out of Europe. Yeah. Finest Italian wood right there. It's just, you know, you get it from everywhere. I mean, and when you come back from, let's say, like a late night in class, like after football, you come and relax. We got a little pillow, just lay down on the couch, get a blanket. We got these uh, waterfalls that are supposed to soothe your soul. That's our, um, that's our feng shui, if you would. Right <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is the gem of living room right here. This is the, I'll let Aaron go ahead and do that right there. We got a little matting going on. Living on the, the best matchup of the nation. <laughs> 57 inches right here, you know, coming out of this, you know, coming out the wall, all angles, moving up and down. You got the PS3, you got a little candy ball, you know, for the sweet tooth. Are we? Everybody got to play with me. You got to play some we ball, whatever. Invitations going out to everybody. First down. <laughs> Go here into the kitchen. This is it, basically. You got our microwave, oven up here in the cabinets. You know, we got down there, we got paper towels, unlimited supply right there, but a little sneak peek right here is pretty much done, but that's my little Oreo pudding right there, it's a little secret recipe right there, if you ever want some, you know, I throw down on the desserts every, you know, whatever I feel like, you just come in, you know, it's kind of easy, so, it's whatever. Alright, so, next, I'm about to take my bathroom, um, this is just a soothing place right here. Um, got some mem memorabilia right here. Life is not measured by the number of breaths we take, but by the moments that take our breath away. Got some stuff just to ease your mind, faith and harmony. Important things in my life. I'm over here, we got the soaps. Gotta have a little variety. Got three different flavors of soaps right here. You can smell good, pick a flavor any day of the week, whichever one you're feeling. Got the lotion, this is probably my pride and joy right here. Got the Disney, that's where it's at. Probably one of the top quality things to have. Just got some Mickey Mouse. And even got uh, some hand soap to match it. So I mean, we just set that right over here. Whichever your guests like to use. Some like to smell good, some like the other one plain. But, all right, so now I'm gonna take you in to my bedroom. Got the Minnesota rug, represent pride for the team. You gotta step on that when you come in, just let them know. Because every time we win, we go and sing our song, fight song on the M, so that's very important. Um, over here is my desk. Just got a couple of books. Um, Batman, probably one of the best superheroes. Victor might not agree. But then we got Uncommon, got some books. Tony Dungy, Uncommon. Got some cookbooks things to help eat healthy. This is good for body. Good things to do. Uh, then got this award. I got this award last year. Uh, this is for being competitive both on the field and in the classroom. So yeah, I had to show that. Then up here on my board, I just got just some random stuff like that I, that I thought were very important. Got some stuff from the football banquet. Uh, some quotes from FCA, which is Fellowship of Christian Athletes. Just some good Bible verses and stuff to look back on. Thinking about things, I got the volleyball first round that they won this year and to make it to the Sweet 16. Um, got this Halloween card that's got some good jokes on it that my mom sent me for Halloween. And then up here, <laughs> up here I got some pictures I drew. Drew in class last semester for my art class. Just. Little, little different views of my identity, both public and self-image. Follow the wall over here. My freshman, my freshman year jerseys. Freshman year we went to the Insight Bowl. 
So that was pretty fun, out of Arizona, just doing big things. Then got my bed right here. This is probably the most comfortable place in the house. Don't let Victor lie to you and say his is more comfortable. Got the memory foam mattress, double layer with the two comforters and two blankets. Got the football on one side. So, we now keep it warm. And this is also my pride and joy right here. Surround sound system with all these movies. I'm a movie collector, so this is just a little sneak peek of some of the movies I got. We got Tron Legacy, Underworld. By the way, the new Underworld that just came out is real good. When saw that opening night, got Conan the Barbarians. A little mix of everything, some Scooby-Doo, you can't go without a little cartoons. And then, kind of my window, sort of the same view you saw out there, but you got a little different angle. Got a lot, a lot of good things to see. Got a little haunted house looking type house over here, sort of casually. Like, do the old, like, medieval feel. So that's sort of nice. And then you got the neighborhood out there. So, I mean, it's a good, it's a nice little spot. You can see all the cars come in. So, you know, when people come in and leave. And then, let's see. Oh, up here, can't forget this. Up here, we got just a little, little variety. Of a little taste of where I'm from. I'm from St. Louis, Missouri. So I got a little bit to represent. Gotta represent my hometown, St. Louis. And then I got some, I got my name right here. Angel's hat. I got an Iron Man hat. Just trying to keep things fresh. And then on this wall, I got my, this is my dream boy right here. This is something that motivates me every day. I just look at it and then it tells, like it reminds me of some of the goals I have in life. Just taking every day, one step at a time. Like eventually wanting to get married and have kids. One of, one of my biggest things, I want to do an Old Spice commercial. That's one of my goals once I graduate. So looking forward to that. And then uh, right here, there's something important to me. It's my sister's uh, fiance. Uh, he just died last year, so I just got to keep him. Know he's always watching over us. So. And that's pretty much my room, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give it to Victor. Well, you know, that's all good. You know, Aaron, good kid. That's why I'm living with him, you know, trying to get everything right, you know, following his footsteps. But if you all know Aaron, he usually don't have his hair braided and he has the afro, so I don't know why he has all those hats up there. But yeah. whatever, decoration. Bathroom first, share with my roommate right here, but not like Aaron, you know. Bathroom. I barely shower. I probably shower here on the weekends and that's it. Everything happens at football, but you know. Got the toothbrush up here, clothes, you know. I take care of myself. I got about four or five lotions back there, the deodorant, the colognes, the my hair products, you know, gotta keep the waves, got the ocean in my head, so it's cool, but you know, that's just a little small area of the house right there. We'll take it over here into the This is King size bedroom for the king. It's whatever, but we'll start it off over here with the bed. Aaron's talking about his is the most comfortable, but he's never laid down, so it's cool. You know, I spend all my time in there, so whatever. Over here, you know, I got my beverages. Got to stay hydrated. This is a little paint over here I got from my man, Brooks Michael. He's probably going to want that back soon after he sees it, but whatever. My man, Bob Marley. Want to embrace my heritage, you know. I'm Jamaican, so got to keep that all in there. Down here, we just, you know, got a couple of my shoes. I just got rid of a lot of them. I had over like 35 pairs, but finally had to make that change. I'm a little desk area, you know, gotta get the brand new, you know, gotta get the good grades, gotta wanna play, so over here basically is just where I sit down. Gotta take a chair from out here, because 412 does not provide us with desk chairs, so I don't get it, but whatever, but it's cool. Over here I take it to surround sound, you know, this is the little area right here, got the TV up in the, on the wall and stuff, so. Game ball we got over, um, we all got from the Miami of Ohio game, so that was fun, you know. It means a lot. Over here on my walls, just got some pictures of my friends. Over here is my family. This is my girlfriend, Bobby, right here. If y'all know who she is, then I don't really have to say much. We could do a whole other episode on that, so I'll just leave it there. But um, up here, I got my boots up here, going down. Got my jackets, like my dress clothes right here. Got my shorts, so we probably won't see those for a couple more months, but. Some hats in the background. Over here is my um, Bobby wall and my family, and, you know. So, you know, family is real important to me. So, you know, I like to keep them everywhere and keep them in my head. So, you know, I'm from Florida, so they're real far. So, as long as you know, I can get up every day and see them, it's just like another 
motivating factor. But uh, over here, more clothes, more jackets. Got my jeans over there. Kind of just goes on. I probably need to throw some of this away, but I'll work on that. But is that a Spider-Man shirt? That's you know. I didn't take the tags off yet, but glow in the dark. Spider-Man. I got the tattoo. Say hi to my. Got a little cup. Well, neighborhood Spider-Man. You know, always doing you justice. But it's cool. Batman can't fly, Batman can't do anything, but Batman's just really a normal guy, kind of like Aaron. So I think that's why he relates to him so well. Spider-Man on the other hand, you know, you know, just <laughs> swinging everywhere, you know, it's whatever, but I like to think of myself as supernatural, so it's, it's cool, it's whatever. First off right here, maybe this will get his attention. This is Kenny Watkins right here, this is his bag. He came over here and did some laundry a few months ago, and he still has his bag of clothes left. Kenny Watkins. If you want to see this, these clothes again, come get them. Because I'm going to start going through them and start wearing them. So, it's whatever. But basically, this is it, you know. Big room for a big guy, whatever. I understand why Aaron wanted to take the smaller room, but we'll go back out here. <laughs> but yeah, basically, this is where we come home to relax every day after football. Well, of course, over here. Wash and dryer, probably the most used thing in the house. I don't get it, I never will. Why Aaron has clothes to wash every second of the day. When if he's not right there on that couch doing his homework, he's at the Mac doing his homework. So it really makes no sense to me, but whatever, I guess the kid likes to stay clean, so I don't know. You got any other thing else you want to say? No, we're gonna have to leave now. Cause we got work to do, work gotta to get do, good grades, you know. Golden Gophers come to a ball near you soon. Yeah. So, go Gophers and hey, let's go. Age, you know. Big 10 champs, Rose Bowl. Ain't gotta go home, but 